Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I will give another problem on Simpsons 3A rule. See, apply Simpsons 3A rule to evaluate integral 0 to 6 e power x by 1 plus x dx. This is the given function approximately. Okay. Uh, already we know that we can apply Simpson 3 8th rule only when the number of sub intervals is a multiple of 3. Okay. So, we should divide the range into 3 equal parts, otherwise 6 equal parts, otherwise 9 equal parts, otherwise 12 equal parts, etc. So, it is better to let us divide the range into 6 equal parts. See. Let us divide the range. Range is nothing but limits of the given interval, the limits of the given integration 0, 6 into 6 equal parts. 6 is a multiple of 3. That is why no problem. So, that is n is equal to 6. Immediately, you have to find out step size otherwise interval difference b minus a by n which is equal to 6 minus 0 by 6 is equal to 1. So, interval difference is 1. Now, we consider the data values for x and y. Now, we consider the data values for x and y. as below. So, write x values and uh, below y values, y is nothing but given function, sometimes it can also represented with f of x. Always we have to start the x values with the lower limit which is 0 and uh, at lower limit 0 to h value. So, 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, again you can add the step size. So, 1 plus 1, 2, 3, again you can add h value, you will get 4, again add h value, you will get 5, 5 plus 1 again, which is 6. So, we reached the upper limit. Now, we have to calculate the functioning value of y at a various values of x by using scientific calculator at a time c. So, mod table which is seventh option. Okay. We have to represent e power x by 1 plus x now. So, take this symbol shift ln power x can be written as rcl this bracket division 1 plus x rcl this one. So, I entered the given function calci is equal to. So, what is the starting value of x? 0 is equal to. What is the ending value of the x? Which is the upper limit? You can take it is 6. What is the step size in the given problem? H value is 1. So, you can give 1 again. So, this is the data. See, first value is at x is equal to 0, functioning value is 1. At x is equal to 1, functioning value is 1.3591. If x is equal to 2, then what is the functioning value? 2.463. Scroll down, you will get another value. Functioning value at 3 is 5.3. 0, 2, 1, 3. Okay, again scroll down. The functioning value at 4 is, see the last column, 10.919. 10.919. Scroll down again. So, at functioning, at x value 5, functioning value is 24.735. Finally, at a 6, x value is 6 and functioning value is 57.632. So, 
So, put the names for y values y not, y1, y2, y3, y4, y5, y6. Now, write the formula for Simpson's 3a rule. Simpson's 3 rule for given data. For given data is integral 0 to 6. Integral 0 to 6 given function is e power x by 1 plus x dx is equal to 3 h by 8 sum of first and last ordinates which are y0 plus y6 plus 2 into sum of ordinates which are multiple of 3 only between first and last which is only y3 here plus 3 times of sum of remaining all ordinates which are y1 plus y2 plus y4 plus y5 substitute these all values and calculate h value is 1 so 3 times of 1 is only 3 by 8 first value is 1 and last ordinate is 57.632 plus 2 times of y3 is 5.0213 plus 3 times of y1 1.3591 plus what is y2 2.463 plus y4 value is 10.919 ok and uh, y5 which is 24.735 close the bracket ok by using scientific calculator we can get this value see so 1 plus 57.632 First, operate the values which are in the square bracket for our convenience plus 2 times of 5.0213 close the bracket sorry there is a mistake here it is uh, 57 point 5 point 5 point 0 2 1 3 close the bracket plus 3 times of 1.35 nine one plus two point four six three plus ten point nine one nine plus twenty four point seven three five is equal to you should multiply this entire value with a three so into three is equal to so this is the numerator value you should divide with the eight now it's equal to eight so you will get 70.1635 right in the bracket approximately this is the approximate value of the given integration according to Simpson's 3 rule.